Mrs. Raphael, the man who is going to supervise the entire abduction, has arrived. He is an elaborate swordsman's costume, appears at the back of the government's park and swaggers walks down the streets proudly. Bagamit. Descending from the wall and bowing low to Safarel, allow me to introduce you to my friend Pascano. Bagamin tells him that he would introduce him to Pascano, but Safarel doesn't see anybody around. He raises his head, looks around, but doesn't see anyone. Bagamin. Pointing to Pascano on the crest of the wall, Bagamin points to Pascano. Pascano couldn't be seen by Straforel because Pascano was sitting on the top of the wall, crest of the wall, there on the wall. Then Bagamin tells Straforel, look at my friend sitting on the wall. On the wall now, my dear master, is my plan okay to you? Do you approve of my plan? Staffordel says it does is it is very simple. The plan is very simple and we approve of that. Bagamin. You must act quickly, you understand? Staffordel. Say nothing about it, it's just leave it to me. Bagamin. A make believe abduction. Bagamin says, Don't worry, I'll manage everything. It's going to be a make believe. Make believe here, not real, a fake abduction and a staged fight with the swords. There is a fake abduction followed by a staged fight. Safarel, so I understand perfectly. Okay, don't worry about it. I'll manage it perfectly. Bagamin, you must have skillful swordsmen. Your swordsman fighter should be experts. Otherwise, my boy will be hurt. I can't have my boy hurt my boy. Personet will get hurt, so he's my only child. Staffordel says, don't worry, I'll see to that myself. I'll see that your son doesn't get hurt. Bagamin, good, in that case, I shall fear nothing. Okay, we'll proceed. Paskinot, aside to Bagamin, Paskinot whispers in the ear of Bagamin, just ask him the price. How much money is he going to charge for the abduction? Bagamin says, for an abduction master, how do you charge now? Mr. Bagamin asks Staffordel how much he charges for an abduction. Staffordel says, that depends. There are many kinds of abduction. So that depends on, my charge depends upon the kind of abduction that you are going to have. That depends, Mashu, on the kind you wish, the kind of abduction that you wish. We have them at all prices. So we have got different kinds of abduction priced differently. In an affair of this kind, however, nothing should be spared. We should be very, very careful. The plan should be executed very carefully. If I were in your place, I should have a first class abduction. So you can't choose an ordinary kind of abduction. Even though it is a bit expensive, I feel that you should select the first class abduction. Bagamin, surprise. Then you have got many classes. Oh, you have got many kinds of abduction, many class of abduction. Stuff for it. Indeed, I have is, I have different kinds of abduction. I have the ordinary vulgar abduction in a cab. Cab is a carriage. With two men dressed in black, that is rarely used. The most ordinary kind of abduction is done in a cab with two men dressed in black, but I rarely use that because that's very ordinary and dirty. The second kind of abduction that I have got is called the daylight abduction. Then I have the midnight abduction. Then the pompous abduction, pompous here, showy something that looks very gorgeous. The pompous abduction in a coat carriage with powdered servants. Powdered servants are servants with makeup. Wigs are extra, headgears are extra. With mules, uh, mules, A-M-U-L-E-S, it's an animal. Mules, Negroes, brigands, 
brigands are armed thieves brigands are armed thieves so he says uh, wigs are extra wigs are headgears these are extra with mules animals negroes brigands armed thieves musketeers musketeers are foot soldiers armed with a musket a gun musket is a gun musketeers anything you like that is a pompous abduction then the abduction in a post chase abduction in a post chase post chase is a carriage close horse drawn carriage with a four wheels with two three four five horses ad lib ad lib as you like the discreet and quiet abduction the next one is a discreet done indirectly discreet nobody will know it's a case of abduction and quiet it is not showy very simple abduction in a small carriage that wants rather lugubrious lugubrious looking sounding sad dull so that is quite opposed to the, the pompous kind of abduction that we have then the rollicking abduction rollicking lively amusing abduction in which the victim is carried away in a sack the victim is carried away in a bag in a sack then we have the romantic abduction the romantic abduction in a boat that is done in a boat uh, but you need to have a lagoon for that lagoon body of water a body of water separated from the sea by a sand bank or a coral reef but you need to have a lagoon for that but you don't have lagoon in your place so that is a rule down the venetian abduction in a gondola gondola is a flat bottomed boat so venetian kind of abduction done on a boat uh, you have no lagoon to do that so that is ruled out uh, romantic abduction the venetian abduction is ruled out as you don't have a, a lagoon here moonlight abduction or the abduction on a dark and starless night the moonlight abduction can also be done easily or if you don't want that if you don't want that we can have an abduction on a dark and starless night those moonlight abductions are quite the style though they are a little dear moonlight abductions are going to be very beautiful but only thing is that it's a bit expensive besides these there is a abduction by torchlight another kind of abduction done by the torchlight with the cries and screams the clash and shock of arms shock of arms shock of weapons so there will be fight accompanied by cries screams etc the brutal abduction the brutal very bad cruel abduction the polite abduction the classical abduction with a mask classical abduction is going to be highly splendid then the gallant abduction gallant abduction to the accompaniment of music a romantic kind of abduction which is to be which is done to the accompaniment of music but the latest the most stylish and gayest brightest of all is a sedan chair abduction sedan chair abduction is going to be the stylish most stylish the brightest of all sedan chair is an enclosed chair for transporting one person carried between horizontal poles by two people to potters so that is going to be the stylish the most stylish the more the gayest of all kinds of abductions bagaman stretching his head side to pascano well what do you think which one should we choose pascano hmm what do you feel okay you decide bagaman i think that we should do everything in the best possible way no expense spare bagaman is not my surly so he says that i think we should select the best we shouldn't grumble the expenses expenses of money spent on that let us give our young romances our children something they will never forget let us have it with the mask dark mantles mantles a uh, clocks uh, dresses clocks touches music and sedan chair so we'll select the sedan chair abduction which is going to be the most stylish 
stuff for real taking doors, a first class then with all extras, correct? Bagamin, that's it. Stuff for real. I'll come back soon to pass a note. Remember, Mashu, to leave open the door of your park tonight. So that's okay. Everything, uh, I'll take care of everything. I'll come back soon. But remember to leave open the door of your park tonight. Bagamin, very well, it shall be done. Stuff for real, poem. My compliments, my best wishes, regards, turning to go. One first class with extras, he goes out. One first class, I've dashed with some extras. Paskinod tells Bagamin, the honest man went without telling us a price. He has not caught him the price. Okay, we'll have to find out. Bagamin, everything is arranged. Now we'll live together after demolishing the wall. Bagamin is too excited to think about the money. He says, now everything is arranged. Hereafter, we'll demolish the wall between us and live together as one family. Paskinod. And in winter, we'll have one hearth and home, fireplace. Hearth is fireplace. So we'll have one kitchen, one fireplace, and one home in winter. Bagamin, our dearest wishes are about to be realized. Our dreams are going to be realized soon. Paskinod. And we'll grow old together. So I'll support you, you support me. Bagamin, dear old Paskinod. Paskinod responds saying, Oh dear old Bagamin, they embrace Silver and Persinet enter from each side of the stage and see their fathers hugging each other.